to make a good Blizzard commercial. What time is it? It's 6.30. And there it is. We're all snowed in. What is all that? Yeah. Yeah, Mom. Oh! Alright, this is Jeremy, and this is your tour of life in Minnesota. Alright, everybody, how's it going? It's uh, 8 o'clock, 8.30 at night. This is the video. This is Battling the Snow in Minnesota. First big snowstorm of the year. I'm going to take you on a tour of life in the frozen tundra. And we have snow. That's my car. In the background here. So I'm all bundled up in the ski gear. We got about anywhere from three to three inches to about a foot and a half, two feet or so in the drifts way over by the boat and stuff there. So it's a tough life, but you know, someone's got to do it, right? So it's not too bad actually. This is my driveway anyway, and uh, Probably be doing some snow removal here later on tonight with your friend Jared. So, um, Jared and Jeremy video take number 10. And I uh, hope you guys like it and that it is entertaining. So, without further ado, I don't want to get started. I think I'll get some hot chocolate first or something. Alright, this is it. The snow annihilator. It don't look like much. This is my favorite one. And uh, hopefully it helps us kick some snow's ass. Because we don't care. You think we're intimidated by some snow? We're intimidated. We're not intimidated by that. We're going to go out there and kick some snow's ass. We're going to make the snow our... We're going we're gonna to make it submit. Look at that. Damn, I didn't know. I was like... Oh. Well, I should measure. I'm guessing seven inches on top of there. Yeah, right, like I'm going to be able to find a damn tape in this mess. Haven't been in the shop in a long time, guys. Hence the no videos, but I don't know. We're looking at about eight inches there. And the Calvary is on the way. I sent in for the Calvary. It's on the way. Rock and roll. It's ass kicking time, that's for sure. I pushed all the sidewalks into the driveway. I got these two lines here for you. One there and one over there. This is your standard uh, snow plowing uh, job here in the uh, Twin Cities, uh, local neighborhood. This is a uh, pretty typical, pretty typical setup here. And uh, a lot of guys like to just drive up to the front, drop the plow, and drag it back. But uh, we kind of wanted to make an igloo or something over here, so we're going to see if we can get it all over there. Oh, Jared, you're neat! Yay! Don't get in there yet, Lexa, you're going to ruin it. We gotta make it big and then you gotta let it sit and freeze for a little while. Just like on Survivor, man.
you'll suck it if you're a plow driver and there's grass and dirt in your snow pile. That's how you know you suck. Yeah. Turn this off. Oh. Or if that happens, right? No, that's not happening. It's called hitting a curb. Most, hey, what's the most thrilling part about this job, Jared? Well, you know, it's probably the extra stamina I have to use to get up this late. Is it extra stamina or is that just about the time you get up anyway? Well, I'm really, I'm usually playing Call of Duty right now at this time. Well, it's kind of the same thing, you got the, you know, yeah, you get to play with it. Yeah, it's kind of like, kind of like a, just moving a, it's a real live game. video game. But I'm actually getting paid for this, though. I mean, if you ask me, I'd rather be this than playing Call of Duty, even though I enjoy Call of Duty. I mean, snow plowing, I mean, they actually pay you to sit around and do, and do something stupid. <laughs> I'm just pushing stuff and they're paying me thousands. Turn the wipers off. That's annoying. That's part of the experience, dude. The annoying wipers? I'm gonna ask you to turn the camera off for Is that fun? I don't know, but whatever kid gets that snow mountain in front of you, it's gonna be a one happy kid. Happy, happy, happy. <laughs> happy, 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 happy. So, this is the life. This is what it's like. This is retarded. Yeah, it's, uh, uh, we got here at 10.30, or uh, 10.05, and it's now, I think, 2 o'clock in the morning? 2.15. 2.15, and um, I'm just, uh, I just took about a 30, 35 minute break, because I am shot. I am not built for this right now, so. Alright. Well, back to work here. So. <clears throat> it's 3 o'clock. Out of 50 of these. This is all, this is what they look like when I'm done. Some of them don't look this good because they're so deep, so I just did like a little path. But I gotta do it across the front here. Across the front of the grass door. Plow can't get all the way up to it. Anyways, um, so that's, uh, I got about six more complexes to go. No, out of 50, I have about 38 done. 38 out of 50. Here we go. My feet hurt, my ankles hurt, my calves hurt, my thighs hurt, my back hurts, my upper back, my lower back. I think I, I think my side backs hurt. That would be what your your wings. What are those called again? Okay, guys, it's the next morning. So either I'm the biggest wuss, or that was the hardest work I've done in like six years. We uh we left here about uh, nine. 30 uh, and we got to the we only have one account so we got to the one account at 10.05 I think is what I said in the video uh, we finally got wrapped up at about 5 in the morning 
just me and the trusty shovel. Yeah. Then it was finally done, and I couldn't believe it. I didn't have a whole lot of energy to even hold a camera and make a video, much less battery life. I'm going to go talk to the neighbor over here since she's outside and ask her if she uh, wants any snow plowing done. All right, well, it seems her husband has a snowblower. Um, here's what we got to get working on now. Well, I'm not working on it, but now you guys couldn't really see much, so we're going to come out this morning here and kind of see what we did. i got to plow this out now, right now. Before I get a ticket, and I'll get you guys some action shots. The Annihilator 2000. When it's fresh snow, it's a breeze. And do two passes, and it's good. But not now. Yesterday it melted a little bit. It was a little warm out right when it was falling, and then last night it froze again. So what happens is it'll melt, and then it freezes. That's a lot harder. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed our little trip last night. It's some YouTube video. So that's it for me, guys. That's it for this video. So that's it for me, guys. Take it easy. If you're up this way and you got snow too, I'm talking to you, Muddy Water Six. So shout out to Muddy Water Six channel. To everybody out there, YouTube world. Take it easy. God bless. Peace. I go get Ashlyn up first. See what she's up to. Then I'll probably sleep the rest of the day again.